Welcome to Sri Ram Medical College. Today we will explore Leading the way in medical laboratory, B. Walk in medical lab technology at Sri Ram Medical College. A medical laboratory technician plays an important role in the basic level of patient care and is responsible for determining whether or not there is a disease by analyzing blood and other bodily fluids. The field of laboratory medicine has undergone a remarkable wave of innovation in the past five decades that has transformed it from a peripheral to a central element of healthcare delivery. New testing methods were introduced and performed on a large scale, some in decentralized settings, in a precise and accurate manner, which led to better diagnoses and better patient care. There were both sustaining and disruptive innovation factors involved in the evolution. An innovative concept, technology, product, or process that appears inferior at first, but ultimately replaces what exists. Disruptive innovations involve the development of new concepts, technologies, products, or processes that seem inferior at first, but ultimately replace existing ones. Medical advances are often made possible through laboratory technology. Before effective treatment is available, testing techniques are available for diagnosing or screening for a particular condition. As a result of advances in laboratory technology, which includes both new tests and advances in equipment and testing techniques, testing has become more efficient and automated. An experienced pathologist is capable of making accurate diagnoses and interpreting complex test results from ancillary methods such as molecular diagnostics and flow cytometry. As part of the pre-analytic stages, a patient must be prepared, the specimen must be collected, the specimen must be transported, and any specimen preparation work must be conducted on a daily basis. A specimen is tested in the analytical stage, and all routine procedures are completed up to the reporting of results. In the post-analytic stage, the focus is primarily on forwarding results to the appropriate hospital department or physician, as well as performing routine daily maintenance and shutdown activities. A pneumatic tube system is used in hospitals for the efficient transfer of specimens. Independent laboratories often transport specimens manually to the testing site by courier. In most clinical settings, specimens are collected, labeled, and entered manually into the laboratory computer system. The majority of decisions regarding specimen volume and container type are made by laboratory technicians instead of machines. In the collection and processing of specimens, ordering tests over the Internet may increase efficiency and reduce administrative errors. Using automated technology, multiple tests can be run on the same sample simultaneously under the name of panels or profiles. The hematology laboratory has evolved in a similar manner, where counting blood cells has been consolidated and expanded to include automatic differentials on the same instrument. Within minutes, a chemistry, hematology, coagulation, or urinalysis analyzer can produce highly accurate and precise results. The use of automated processes to replace manual steps virtually eliminated the possibility of errors and reduced test error rates. Improved technical precision and accuracy were achieved through improvements in automated processing. In addition to specimen transportation, storage, and disposal, electronic systems may also be used. Finally, these systems are designed to ensure consistency of results and to alert medical personnel to the presence of panic values. It is possible that billing and collection processes will become more automated in the future.
Laboratory systems provide payers with all necessary documentation for billing, for example, patient's name, address, primary and secondary insurance information. Develop practical skills in the use of complex, high-throughput, and automated laboratory instruments for analyzing patient samples in order to determine clinical diagnosis. When a test is ordered, the information is typically transmitted manually. A system that automatically sends updated information electronically every time a test is ordered would be more efficient if it were integrated with electronic systems. Following the laboratory's submission of results to the physician, several steps must be taken by both the physician and the patient. The physician must interpret the results after receiving the results and determine what they mean for the patient. There are times when normal ranges are provided in laboratory reports or a written explanation is provided to assist the physician in interpreting the results. To better understand the meaning of test results, a physician may consult with a laboratory technician. The next step is for the physician to decide what action to take. Depending on the results of the laboratory tests, the patient may not require any action other than to be informed of his or her results. Further tests may be ordered, the patient may be admitted to a hospital, the prescription may be changed, a new treatment program may be initiated, and the patient may be monitored more closely. In order to achieve the best possible outcome for the patient, it is not only necessary to obtain an accurate test result. Moreover, it is dependent on the physician's interpretation as well as the patient's response. It is both incremental and breakthrough developments that lead to advancements in laboratory testing technology. Testing processes are often made simpler, more efficient, and often less expensive, through incremental changes. Less frequently, technological advances result in completely new tests or testing methods. The location of some laboratory tests has been moved out of the laboratory and closer to the patient. A point-of-care test, POCT provides quick test results within minutes of taking the sample, while a home test provides the ultimate consumer convenience. In the 21st century, clinical laboratories will continue to undergo a technological revolution. The development of new technologies in laboratory testing will be responsible for many medical advances. Healthcare services delivered by new technologies are more efficient, reduce errors, and are of higher quality. The adoption of new technologies may be determined by their cost impact on laboratories and, if they are more expensive, by payers' willingness to pay for them. The trend towards automating central laboratories is likely to continue, however, POCT and home-based testing may be able to provide much routine testing in the future. There is a likelihood that centralized laboratories will focus more on esoteric testing. Laboratory staffing requirements will change significantly as a result of automation and changes to the sites where laboratory services are delivered. Experts in the monitoring and maintenance of robotic equipment, as well as allied health professionals, are likely to be in high demand. A decrease in labor costs will, however, likely lead to a decrease in test costs as a whole. Bachelor of Vocation Degree, B.VOC, in MLT Courses Eligibility Criteria 12th class with minimum score of 50% from any recognized board. Students, arts, commerce, science, of any age can apply. 
join Sri Ram Medical College and take the first step toward a successful career in medical laboratory technology. We are here to assist you in launching your career as a medical lab technologist. Call us at 9968193009 for more information about our program or to submit an application right away. Sri Ram Medical College, nurturing next generation of healthcare leaders, and offers all paramedical courses at competitive fee and helps in 100% placement assistance. Admission open. For more information, please visit our website sriramcollege.com and like, share, subscribe, our YouTube channel Sri Ram Medical College. Good luck, goodbye.